Welcome back. Today we'll continue our series in JavaScript tutorials. In this series, we'll try to answer questions that you may face in your interviews that are related to JavaScript. Um, if this sounds interesting for you, please feel free to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you'll never miss a video. And yeah, let's try to answer this question. So basically, the question for today is that what all the what is the purpose of the read the splice the splice method? And um, this type of prob of of, of of problems um you need to do to provide your interviewer two things the purpose and the usage first let's talk about what is the array display so the array display method in javascript is used to change the content of uh, an array by removing replacing or adding elements to its providing provide uh, uh, to it it provides a versatile way to manipulate arrays and let's just talk about the purpose. First, I want to talk about the purpose. And uh, and what comes to my mind, mainly three things. One is that removing elements from the array. So you can use uh, the splice to remove elements from an array by uh, specifying the starting index and uh, the number of the elements to remove. Number two, um, I would say we uh, have the replacing element. We could replace, yeah, replace element, and uh, you can replace elements in array by specifying the starting index, uh, the number, um, um, the number of the elements to replace, and the new values to insert. And uh, number three, we can use it for add adding elements. And um, you can here in the splice also um, uh, used to be uh, to insert new elements into the array at a specified index without removing uh, any elements. Uh, let's talk about the usage. Um, let me, um, I'd like to make it uh, quite symmetric here. Yeah. So let's talk about the usage. First, um, the array that splice accept uh, uh, three arguments. We have the start, the index at, uh, at which let's talk about the arguments. We have first the, uh, the start, one, one called start, and this one is uh, the index at which to start the modification of the array, and this is required. Two, we have uh, the delete count. And delete count it's optional. It's um, and this one the number of the elements to remove starting from the start index. Um, if omitted or uh, set to zero, no elements are removed. Um, we have three. We have uh, items one, two, three. This things is optional, and this is the elements to be added to the array at the start index. So let's just give some example first. I want to talk about example in um, in removing. Removing elements. And here let's create um, um, a number. Let's create th this array. For example, I study JavaScript right now. And um, I will create make array the splice. Array or the splice. And I will I will try to um, remove the elements. So I will remove uh, two elements starting at the index one. So from starting the, the uh, oh sorry, I will remove two elements starting at the index one. So the answer should be from index one remove two elements. The answer should be. Can you think about it? If you cancel log the array. Okay, <laughs> you you remove two elements starting from the index one, so we remove this one and then we remove this one. And the second thing we want to talk about the replacing replace elements. Oh, oh, yeah. So by replace element, um, I still have the array. This one I will not change it. I'll correlate array replace. 
and um, in this one I'll try to make a uh, uh, array dot supplies array of place let me let me um I will add a new let 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 add a new one yeah this one will be better and I will say um fruits dot splice for example one one and mango and let's just add uh, orange also so what's oh oh no so what's happening here we are replacing one element at at um at uh, at the index one with uh, grapes and orange or with a ban uh, with mango and orange so basically if you console.log if you console.log the fruits this will be the uh, the uh, the output we replace banana with mango and orange um three we want to add element this is the last thing uh so let's create a new array called animals here let's call it animals and this one is lion tiger and bear and i want to add a new one so i will just say animals dot supplies it will be uh, one and zero and i will add any front and dog okay so what's happening here we insert elephant and dog uh, we insert elephant and dog at the index one we didn't remove anything we we specified the remove with zero so we didn't remove anything so if we cancel log If you cancel log the element, you find that you added two elements here in the index one from index one, and um, the array does the, the the splice method directly modifies the original array and returns an array contains the removed elements if any. Uh, if no elements are removed, it returns the empty array. This makes it powerful tool for array manipulation tasks such as adding, removing, or replacing elements within an array. So yeah, that's it for this video, and I hope you like my content. If you like my content, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you'll never miss a video, and see you guys in future problems.